guys welcome to a brand new video on my channel makes movies if you are new to this channel this is basically where i talk to you guys about my passion for movies this goes from collections hauls reviews and to today's video so let's get into it okay so we're into a brand new year which means brand new movies yes um so if anyone's wondering i am not going to be doing a top 10 best and worst movies of 2023 just for the simple fact of there is so so many films that i never got the chance to watch that i think could have made the list for either list so i am not going to do it i might put it in the community post the ones that i did enjoy the most and the ones i didn't enjoy the least but there will be no official video but i will try and do it this year that is one of my goals for this year um but yeah so my top 10 anticipated list will be in the week i'm not sure when it will be i think it might be might be near the end of the week it might be like friday or saturday i'm not sure yet but that will be coming this week so keep an eye out for that because there's quite a lot of good films coming out this year and i think everyone will know what my number one will be <laughs> um but yeah so that's coming in the week but today because it's obviously it's the first of january i'm giving you guys my january 2024 watch list so this is all the movies coming out in january this month that I want to try and watch. Now, obviously, every time I do these videos, I say I'm going to watch. This year, I'm going to say I'm going to try and watch. And then anything I don't watch this month, I will then add on to the next month. And then the following month after that. Until I watch all of these films. Because my focus this year is on the channel. And getting the movies watched. Because I feel like there's so many good films I could have watched last year that I didn't. And things like that. So this year, my focus will be on the channel a bit more. So, yes, yeah, so there's only five films this month. Um, a couple of them are in the cinema. Unfortunately, due to financial issues, I have had to cancel my cinema membership. So a couple of these I might have to push to next month. But if I have the money and I'm able to go, I will. But yes, yeah, so let's talk about the five movies that I want to watch this month. Now, the first one I'm going to talk about is Good Grief. This is coming on Netflix actually this Friday. So my mum actually pointed this one out to me. She sent me the trailer via Instagram that she found. Uh, this is done by Daniel Levy. Now, we know him from Schitt's Creek as David. Um, and we love the show. And he helped create that show with his dad. So we were like, right, he's good at this show. He's got to be good at this film. And we watched the trailer and it does look like it's going to be a very emotional film. And it looks like it's going to be really good. So thanks to my mum for pointing that out and hopefully we'll be able to watch that together over the weekend. Um, but yeah, so it looks like it's so it's going to be an emotional one. Um, obviously, it's called Good Grief. <laughs> um, but no, it looks good. It looks like it's going to be potentially maybe my top 20 film of the year. It might not make my top 10. I'm not sure. Um, but I think it might be a good start to the year already. Um Oh, another disclaimer. Um, obviously, if there's any other films that are coming out this month, I will try and go and see it. Um, but it's a case of these are the ones that are either coming out at my local cinema or coming to streaming. So before I talk about anything else. <laughs> um, so things like Night Swim, that comes out this month. That's not coming to my local cinema. So that might be one of those ones that I'll have to try and watch throughout the year. I'm not sure. But anyway, getting back to my top, my top five, <laughs> the five movies I want to watch. Uh, the next one is Mean Girls, the musical. I really enjoyed the first Mean Girls. It's funny, it's hilarious, it's very good. <laughs> um, but I look forward to seeing what the musical will be like, because I know this is based on the Broadway show, and I know it's got some of the recurring characters coming back as well. Um, so that's one of the main reasons why I'm going to watch it, just because I feel like... I feel like it might be an all right film, but at the same time, I don't know why, but my gut's telling me it might not be as good as I think it will be. So it might make my top 10 least favourite for this year. Who knows? But I love watching weird and funny films, so hence why it's on the list. Uh, the next one is The Colour Purple. Now, I haven't seen the original. I'm guessing this is a remake. I'm not 100% sure. I didn't do a full research on this. Um, but it is a musical and I like musicals so I thought why not especially with the Mean Girls musical coming out I thought why not add the colour purple plus from the trailer it does look quite good um, but yeah so it does look quite good from the trailer I will probably watch the original and do an original versus remake for it um, but it does look it does look like it could be a good film 
doesn't look much of a musical but I know it is a musical from the little bit of googling I did <laughs> um but it does look like it could be quite a good film uh, another one is Priscilla so this is the one about Elvis Presley's wife um now I've heard mixed things about this film and I've also heard a lot of backlash from this film so that's mainly why I want to watch it is out of curiosity um just because the simple fact of as well I did really enjoy that Elvis film we got a couple of years ago well I think that was a couple of years ago <laughs> um I did enjoy that film more than I thought I would so that's another reason why I want to watch it because it's sort of like I want to watch more things to do with Elvis now it's pretty weird <laughs> um but yeah but because of the whole controversy and from what I've heard and the mixed things I've heard I actually kind of want to see it just for that just out of sheer curiosity and then the last one is The Beekeeper. Now, this is starring Jason Statham. I haven't watched the trailer for it or nothing, so I'm going to go into this one blind. But it does say it's a Sky original. So I have put it on my list because it is coming to my local cinema. However, because it's a Sky original, if I can't get time or if I don't have enough money to go and see it in the cinema, I will be watching it as soon as it hits the Sky, um, si Sky series, Sky channel, because I do have Sky at home, so... It's one of those films that if I end up watching it on streaming, I will. If it's in the cinema, I'll try and watch it. But because I know it's going to potentially come up free somewhere else, I might just wait. But I liked Jason Statham. I'm starting to get more into his films, um, especially with the Expendable films, with him being in those. Uh, Fast and Furious, him being in some of those films as well. So he's starting to grow on me a little bit more. So I would like to see more of his stuff. Um... But yeah, so they're the top five that I want to watch. Obviously, if there's anything else coming out that is brand new that I might want to watch, I will. Um, I'm going to try and do more reviews on this channel as well, so keep an eye out for those. Um, it might be a couple of days after I've watched the film, or it might be on the day. Who knows? But I will be reviewing every movie that I watched this year. Because that's something I really wanted to do last year, and I never got around to doing it. And this year, I'm feeling very motivated, so... <laughs> so yeah so that is all the movies i want to watch in the month of january obviously i'll be watching other things along the way as well random films um if i'm working on any rankings i'll be watching those so yeah so it's just for the 2024 list that's what i'm watching so yeah i really hope you enjoyed this first video of the year can't believe we're in a new year already feels like time's flying so fast <laughs> um but yes yeah, so i really hope you enjoyed this video if you did then do give it a thumbs up and if you are new to this channel then go ahead hit that subscribe button and also notification bell down below to be notified when i post and then also leave me a comment down below what you think of this list is there anything i should add and what are you looking forward to watching when it comes out let me know in the comments down below and i'll see you guys next time